First property is located at 3183 Esmond Avenue, Burnaby, a condominium unit with two bedrooms and two bathrooms measuring 963 square feet. It was sold on March 1, 2024, for $612,000. This property was sold at a price 3.5% lower than the BC government assessed value. The next property is located at 4900 Lennox Lane, Burnaby, a condominium unit with two bedrooms and two bathrooms measuring 915 square feet. It was sold on March 1, 2024, for $918,000. This property was sold at a price 0.1% lower than the BC government assessed value. The next property is located at 7388 Sanborn Avenue, Burnaby, a condominium unit with two bedrooms and three bathrooms measuring 1,545 square feet. It was sold on March 1, 2024, for $1,212,000. This property was sold at a price 5.8% lower than the BC government assessed value. The next property is located at 6511 Sussex Avenue, Burnaby, a condominium unit with two bedrooms and one bathroom measuring 584 square feet. It was sold on March 3, 2024, for $719,900. This property was sold at a price 3.4% lower than the BC government assessed value. The next property is located at 4189 Halifax Street, Burnaby, a condominium unit with two bedrooms and two bathrooms measuring 855 square feet. It was sold on March 3, 2024, for $840,000. This property was sold at a price 1.1% lower than the BC government assessed value. The next property is located at 6511 Sussex Avenue, Burnaby, a condominium unit with two bedrooms and two bathrooms measuring 758 square feet. It was sold on March 3, 2024, for $904,000. This property was sold at a price 7.4% lower than the BC government assessed value. The next property is located at 4650 Brentwood Boulevard, Burnaby, a condominium unit with three bedrooms and four bathrooms measuring 1,500 square feet. It was sold on March 3, 2024, for $1,618,000. This property was sold at a price 3.4% lower than the BC government assessed value. The next property is located at 7377 Salisbury Avenue, Burnaby, a condominium unit with two bedrooms and one bathroom measuring 916 square feet. It was sold on March 4, 2024, for $580,000. This property was sold at a price 8.5% lower than the BC government assessed value. The next property is located at 6595 Willingdon Avenue. Burnaby, a condominium unit with two bedrooms and two bathrooms measuring 942 square feet. It was sold on March 4, 2024, for $625,000. This property was sold at a price 5.2% lower than the BC government assessed value. The next property is located at 6098 Station Street, Burnaby, a condominium unit with one bedroom and one bathroom measuring 608 square feet. It was sold on March 4, 2024, for $720,000. This property was sold at a price 0.3% lower than the BC government assessed value. The next property is located at 6658 Dow Avenue, Burnaby, a condominium unit with two bedrooms and two bathrooms measuring 907 square feet. It was sold on March 4, 2024, for $887,000. This property was sold at a price 2.5% lower than the BC government assessed value. The next property is located at 6288 Cassie Avenue, Burnaby, a condominium unit with two bedrooms and two bathrooms measuring 966 square feet. It was sold on March 4, 2024, for $1,070,000. This property was sold at a price 0.3% lower than the BC government assessed value. The next property is located at 7088 14th Avenue, Burnaby, a condominium unit with two bedrooms and two bathrooms measuring 882 square feet. It was sold on March 5, 2024, for $765,000. This property was sold at a price 0.3% lower than the BC government assessed value. The next property is located at 4485 Skyline Drive, Burnaby, a condominium unit with two bedrooms and two bathrooms measuring 835 square feet. It was sold on March 5, 2024, for $928,228. This property was sold at a price 2.1% lower than the BC government assessed value. The next property is located at 6000 McKay Avenue, Burnaby, a condominium unit with one bedroom and one bathroom measuring 600 square feet. It was sold on March 7, 2024, for $732,500.
This property was sold at a price 2.9% lower than the BC government assessed value. The next property is located at 3888 Evergreen Place, Burnaby, a condominium unit with two bedrooms and two bathrooms measuring 945 square feet. It was sold on March 7, 2024, for $1,057,000. This property was sold at a price 6.4% lower than the BC government assessed value. The next property is located at 7088 Salisbury Avenue, Burnaby, a condominium unit with two bedrooms and two bathrooms measuring 1,086 square feet. It was sold on March 8, 2024, for $840,000. This property was sold at a price 0.2% lower than the BC government assessed value. The next property is located at 6689 Willingdon Avenue, Burnaby, a condominium unit with one bedroom and one bathroom measuring 665 square feet. It was sold on March 9, 2024, for $455,000. This property was sold at a price 0.6% lower than the BC government assessed value. The next property is located at 6461 Telford Avenue, Burnaby, a condominium unit with two bedrooms and two bathrooms measuring 905 square feet. It was sold on March 9, 2024, for $895,000. This property was sold at a price 3.8% lower than the BC government assessed value. The next property is located at 9150 University High Street, Burnaby, a condominium unit with one bedroom and one bathroom measuring 740 square feet. It was sold on March 10, 2024, for $505,000. This property was sold at a price 4% lower than the BC government assessed value. The next property is located at 5355 Lane Street, Burnaby, a condominium unit with two bedrooms and one bathroom measuring 637 square feet. It was sold on March 10, 2024, for $621,000. This property was sold at a price half a percent lower than the BC government assessed value. The next property is located at 7358 Edmund Street, Burnaby, a condominium unit with two bedrooms and two bathrooms measuring 891 square feet. It was sold on March 11, 2024, for $875,000. This property was sold at a price 1.6% lower than the BC government assessed value. The next property is located at 7358 Edmund Street, Burnaby, a condominium unit with two bedrooms and two bathrooms measuring 865 square feet. It was sold on March 12, 2024, for $850,000. This property was sold at a price 0.1% lower than the BC government assessed value. The next property is located at 1888 Gilmore Avenue, Burnaby, a condominium unit with two bedrooms and two bathrooms measuring 938 square feet. It was sold on March 12, 2024, for $955,000. This property was sold at a price 6.2% lower than the BC government assessed value. The next property is located at 4485 Skyline Drive, Burnaby, a condominium unit with two bedrooms and two bathrooms measuring 919 square feet. It was sold on March 12, 2024, for $985,000. This property was sold at a price 0.2% lower than the BC government assessed value. The next property is located at 2181 Madison Avenue, Burnaby, a condominium unit with two bedrooms and two bathrooms measuring 723 square feet. It was sold on March 13, 2024, for $793,000. This property was sold at a price 5.4% lower than the BC government assessed value. The next property is located at 5333 Goring Street, Burnaby, a condominium unit with two bedrooms and two bathrooms measuring 883 square feet. It was sold on March 13, 2024, for $848,000. This property was sold at a price 2.2% lower than the BC government assessed value. The next property is located at 6638 Dunblane Avenue, Burnaby, a condominium unit with two bedrooms and two bathrooms measuring 866 square feet. It was sold on March 13, 2024, for $908,000. This property was sold at a price 1.9% lower than the BC government assessed value. The next property is located at 4488 Juno Street, Burnaby, a condominium unit with two bedrooms and two bathrooms measuring 959 square feet. It was sold on March 13, 2024, for $970,000. This property was sold at a price 14.7% lower than the BC government assessed value. The next property is located at 6383 McKay Avenue, Burnaby, a condominium unit with two bedrooms and two bathrooms measuring 758 square feet. It was sold on March 14, 2024, for $913,000. This property was sold at a price 0.2% lower than the BC government assessed value.